What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. We pulled this bad boy in here today. We're gonna do a little will it run, will it run, but that didn't work out because we put some diesel in it and it does indeed run. Then we were gonna fix the problem with it being stuck in reverse and we pulled it in, twiddled our fingers on the linkage and it popped right out. Shit. What? I just popped it out. Did you really? Yeah. <laughs> what? I just popped it right out of So pretty much what we're gonna do is just try to get some of this primer off, do a little time lapse on that. And we'll bring you back when we're done. And there's the infamous John. chemical and we ran out of John that's okay we'll get back to it tomorrow the guy I bought it from really nice guy he uh he actually just texted me while we were doing it and he's got some stuff that was in the bed of the truck that uh he asked if I wanted so we're gonna go pick it up it doesn't look like much looks like maybe uh just some wheels and tires and stuff like that but it's junk and I like junk and uh, it's free. So I'll pick that up in the morning. Um, I wish there was more green paint under this stuff. It looks like whoever was messing with it, I guess was going, uh, going for the Winston cup, but uh, I don't know. I think it's going to be a cool little truck, especially for the price. We got about 600 bucks into it. So it runs, it drives. You know, when I bought it, I didn't even know if it would do that. So I'm pretty excited. We'll go pick that stuff up in the morning and we'll get back at it tomorrow. All right, guys, it's the next night. It's pretty much where we left off. We have books open, which is a rarity here, but uh, just a few parts missing up in the cab as far as the, the shifting goes. So just trying to get myself together on that, order some parts. These are the wheels and tires we picked up from the previous owner. Wind up working out. Thought there was a couple of other things that he had, but he didn't. He gave me five wheels, five tires. Um, the two rear tires that came with the truck weren't holding air. Two of the five, oddly enough, were holding air that he gave me. So now we have a little something to uh, drive the car around. Um, we're gonna get back on taking some of this primer off. I got a little more on the other side. Uh, this morning, John went to Chattanooga to pick up more parts for the Cabrio, which is awesome. Um, and he sent some footage, so I'm gonna send them your way and then we'll get back on this. Hey guys, I'm John and welcome back to Lower Class Garage. Uh, on the first video, we showed you Mike and I picking up a VR6 and motor and transmission to uh, swap into my Cabrio. Today, I'm going to be heading out to Cleveland, Tennessee to look at a parts car that a gentleman has from his VR turbo build. Hopefully he's got some leftover stuff um, that I can use for my build. We've talked about a little bit. Hopefully I can get some of that stuff out of him for a good price. Um, on the other note, I know a lot of you are probably very concerned about my bladder. Um, I have this tendency to drink a lot of Red Bull and it makes me have to go to the bathroom a lot. So rest assured today, I have already used the bathroom prior to the filming of this video and we're good to go. All right, so I'll meet back with you guys when I get 
to this guy's house over in Cleveland and we'll take it from there. to Cleveland at this guy's house we got a couple of Jettas here and a bunch of other things he got going on let's see what we can pull out of here all right I'll get all back right, so you. I'm here at the gentleman's house this is Jazzy Jeff that's my boy and we have just acquired this whole Jetta this guy is hooking us up and we're getting it for a steal. Everything I'm gonna need to do my swap. Stay tuned. expected someone was in there doing body work I'm not a body guy doesn't seem like too bad of a job I'm sure someone will say different but it's good enough for what we need it for it's gonna be a shop truck I like to pick pick up junk haul it doing it in the Land Rover not really cutting it so this will be perfect for it I plan on sourcing a interior I like my interiors nice. Just getting it, you know, where I feel comfortable driving at distances. We're gonna lower it for sure. We got a set of wheels that was donated by a good buddy of mine, which has some history with our friends, which I'm really excited about. So that's situated and uh, there's only one thing left to do, and that's do a little backyard rip. Hey guys, it's Thanksgiving morning. Stopped at the store, get the last of the stuff we need. Um, unfortunately, it's raining in the Nashville area, so the backyard rip's not going to go down. But I just want to say thanks for watching. Happy Thanksgiving. Hope you guys have a good one. And uh, next video will be on the bug, so that should be good. Stay tuned. Have a good one. Thank you.